smell that? After a tiring game of football, when you walk through the streets of the city and smell of a pizza baking in the oven, is there any better smell in the world? Just thinking about the delicious bread, mozzarella cheese and spicy tomato sauce makes your mouth wet. You grab the slice and munch down through delicious layers of cheese, veggies and crust. Instead of yum, the first thing that comes to mind is ouch. All you wanted was a big bite of pizza, but all you got was a burnt tongue. The tongue is a sensitive organ. It has to be, so we can taste all those delicious flavors. When exposed to very hot foods and drinks, the tongue like other human tissues, can get burned. So let us understand what exactly happens. The surface of the tongue is made up of tiny round bumps called papillae that contain the taste buds. Inside the bumps are microvilli that look like tiny hairs which further sense temperatures, tastes and textures on the tongue. When anything touches our tongue, these microvilli send signals to the brain where they are decoded to tell us what we taste or feel in our mouth. It is these tissues, the papillae, that get burned or injured by extreme heat or cold. When our tongue gets burned, these taste buds swell and get traumatized. This then disrupts the ability of the microvilli to accurately detect what it is tasting or sensing. As a result, food and drink may taste different after the tongue has been burnt. If you're wondering whether the damage to your tongue is permanent, do not worry. You would have observed that you quickly regain your sense of taste in a day or few hours. This is because the tongue is one of the fastest healing organs of your body, thanks to the tremendous blood flow it receives. The tongue, in fact, heals twice as quickly as other parts of the body. To get more answers to the latest hot questions, subscribe to our YouTube channel and visit our website.